Hi, Sam here with CAD Productivity. Welcome to Civil CAD Consultants Express Tip on extending an alignment while maintaining the bearing. Editing the length of a tangent in an alignment without changing the bearing is not always an easy feat using the horizontal curve set tools. However, with the edit element command, it's a breeze. Edit element is part of the horizontal and vertical elements add-in. If I go to Tools, Application Add-in, scroll down and you'll see that Horizontal and Vertical Elements is already toggled on on my machine. That means under Geometry, I have both a Horizontal Element and Simplified Horizontal Element. If I choose Edit Element, it allows me to edit any one element that's part of the active horizontal alignment. You'll see the first element is highlighted in my active horizontal. I can either select the element I want to edit. I can use first, previous, next, or last to locate the element. Since I'm going to the end, I'll just hit last and notice it highlights the element. Here I need to tell it whether I want to hold the starting coordinate or the stopping coordinate. If I use the stop to define from, it will hold the stopping coordinate or the end coordinate, and if I shorten the element, it will leave a gap between the previous curve and this element, or if I lengthen, it would actually extend it beyond the curve. So I'm going to hold the starting point, so it will keep the element tangent and coincident with the previous curve and I can change the length. I can either shorten or lengthen it. Let's say that I want to make it 2500 feet. I'll apply. The final element is extended and I don't have to worry about the direction because the direction is held constant. Thanks for watching. You can view more tips for MicroStation and inroads at civilcadconsultant.com.